Well, Parkinson's disease is not actually a, a disease. It's a, a syndrome that can be caused by different things and presents in different manners for different people. For that reason, it's really hard to put people into particular categories. Now, that being said, since it's such a common disease, there are people that fit into some of those categories enough that we can use them for research purposes or even for treatment purposes. Uh, there's one called tremor predominant Parkinson disease where people mainly present with tremor in one hand or, or eventually both hands. And it's a flapping tremor that can respond to medications. They usually walk fairly well for a long time. Um, there's also one which is, we call PIGD, which basically means that they have difficulty with their gait and their balance. Uh, they don't have so much of a tremor, although they may or may not. Uh, they may have more problems down the road with cognitive aspects and memory and voice and facial expression than the people with the tremor predominant variety. Uh, now again, those are very broad categories. Uh, there's also a young onset category that we put people in. If you get it earlier than age 50, then that means something different, uh, both in terms of uh, possible genetic in involvement and uh, treatment, um, as well as, you know, um, uh, there's Parkinson plus syndromes, which we can talk about at some other point, um, that uh, means something totally different. So the, the point is that it's, it's very difficult to categorize people with Parkinson's in just one particular uh, category because they present so differently. Each person is different with this disease.